Okay, so hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? I hope that you are fine, amazing, and well. Welcome back to another vlog. Welcome back to another video. Uh, I'm starting off today's vlog. I am moving out real quick. It's around, I believe, uh, around nine ish in the morning, and I'm spending the whole day back at home. It happened to be a Sunday, but I've just, I've, I've just realized that I don't have any soap in the house. So I'm moving real quick to the shops the down to get some soap and hopefully also get some bread. I have actually already like soaked uh, the clothing which I'm going to be starting with. And it has just dawned on me that I don't have the soap. Let me show you real quick before I move out. Uh, so that is the white laundry. I don't have enough light in this room because the bulb did blow. But this is the white laundry and I also have some more laundry here. Yeah, so let me just grab uh, that soap from the shops real quick and I'll come back to that. I also actually have uh, some things I want to be showing you guys. Uh, mini haul. Yes, of some things I've been getting throughout the whole week. I'm also planning to actually read later on because now it's officially around six days to the final examinations of nursing school. Guys, so actually, uh, I went to pick the bread, but I wouldn't find the bread. They had bread, but actually, it was older bread. And how do I know that it's older bread if it's the only one on the stock and there are like four of them, four pieces? So I settled for chapats for now, but hopefully, later on, I'll be going back and to another place to pick a fresh bread. Thank you. 
an update. I've been washing. This is a little bit dark, <laughs> but uh, I've been washing and uh, I'm almost done right now. I'm going to be like uh, scrubbing the the what the the shoes and some sandals and everything. Yeah, just like I usually do. Where footwear generally. Oluzungu. Footwear generally, generally. Oluzungu. <laughs> but anyway, this is uh, the situation going on over here. Uh, these are the shoes which I'm going to be scrubbing right now. That is the whole pile of clothing, and also that is the other colored uh, clothing. I have actually used downy. Uh, I should have used this blue one when I went to buy it from the nearby shop. I actually asked them, do they have like the big jerry can? Uh, which not the big jerry can, but I, the small, like slightly smaller jerry can. It was there, but it was so expensive. So I did it. I I actually just said, let me just buy two of these. And tomorrow happens to be a Monday. End up with a mchikubo. Fingers crossed. I'm going to be passing by a chikubo so that I can buy myself. You know that jerry can of downing. You know the blue one because the blue one actually smells so good. I believe how I wish I, you guys were here to smell. I've just, you know, used just this, even not the whole of it, something like 10 mils. And the whole house smells amazing. Anyway, I want to show you some of the things I've been buying throughout the week. There are actually very few, not a lot of them. But when you hear me saying that I want to show you the things, you can feel like there are very, very absolutely many. The first thing is this scarlet going on over here. You guys, if you're a perpetual watcher of my vlogs, you actually saw me pick up this scarlet. I bought this at 21,000 Ugandan shillings from Chikubo. There is a specific, specified like a wholesale shop for electronics that is where i did get this but when you try to get this from any other shop within kampala they can, it can be around 26 28 even 30,000 you can shillings this is the smallest size yes and uh, i wanted to buy the biggest size because it's no of use to buy the biggest size this is just enough to boil my tea in case i need to bathe you know hot water this also does it better yeah, so I want to unbox this with you guys and show you how it does look like. This is how it does look like going on over here. I believe this is, is it one and a half liters? I think it's one and a half liters or one liter, something like that. Let me first confirm, guys. There is actually a manual, like uh, in the whole package, there is a manual going on over here. It's 1.7 liters, yes, and this is how it does look like. They actually had different, like, different uh, packers or electric kettles. Some of them were for 25, some of them were for 30, 40, and 45, even 60. So the more the price, the more, like, the, the capacity and the more the durability. And this is the base where it does sit when it is cooking. The cable is not that big. Let me know if you want to know where this shop is located. I can pass there, ask them their business number and their location and give it to you probably in the next vlog. But you have to tell me in the comment section below. It's a big shop. It hasn't sponsored this video. It's a wholesale shop. They sell a lot of different things that are very at very, very affordable prices. So, you guys, I finally bought myself a pair of simple sneakers going on over here. These ones were 25,000 Ugandan shillings. I bought them from Chikubo. I actually was moving randomly that day of Black Friday from, from Langida Jewelry Store that was on the 25th of November. And I went to Mulangira and my sister had, you know, sent me some things. I bought them for her. But reaching at Mulangira, actually, I never, you know, 
you know, sassy me. I never, uh, you know, came to conclude with anything I wanted. So I just moved away with my money, went to school. And the evening when I was coming back, I randomly fell on this shop uh, with a, a young, you know, amazing, sweet lady who speaks very, very absolutely well. And I asked her, she had a lot of different options of shoes, but I just wanted something very, very comfortable. And this matched, you know, my aesthetics, if that makes sense. These ones were 25,000 Ugandan shillings and 20 million each tundu. I wanted to buy also another pair, but I said it, it is not, you know, it's not matching to buy two pairs of shoes at the same time when even it was not on my budget. So this is one thing that I've wanted, but I bought when it was off budget. I wear size 40 and around 41, 40, 41, and these ones are 41s. And I love the fact that these ones, they stretch. Guys, can you see this? They stretch. I can easily, you know, work out in them. I can easily move to school with them. I'm about to start working probably next year. And I need something very, very absolutely simple. And these ones, I think that they are going to do it for me very, very absolutely well. There are a few small, small things I did pick up. It's uh, I picked up a new beauty blender going on over here. This was 2000 You've got a shillings. I picked one because I have a little beauty blenders, but I've just realized that I've had them for some good time and I haven't changed them. So one of my good friends, Emily, bought me this and I'm very, very excited to also try it out. This is a deodorant, you know, but I'm very, very excited to try out this and probably I'll be sharing in case I want it. I definitely recommend it for you guys. A pro concealer going on over here. This one is in uh, Toffee DC 984. It's at least something like two to three shades lighter than my skin tone. The other few things that I did pick up that I can't resist to show you guys. Today morning, I picked up a bar of soap. This was uh, 5,800 Uganda shilling. Then I also picked up bread going on over here. This was 2,700 Uganda shillings. Some soy cup going on over here, two sockets. Yeah. Currently, what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to put on some tea. I'm going to be having tea quite late today. It is 47 past one going on over here.